Hey everyone, in this video, I will show you how you can install your own Minecraft server in just minutes, and you can also do it completely for free. The first step is to click the link down below, which will give you a $200 free trial to DigitalOcean, and they have a one-click application to install a Minecraft server. Once you've signed up to DigitalOcean and you've accessed your $200 free trial, you're gonna click Create in the menu and go ahead and click Droplet. DigitalOcean uses the word Droplet, which really just means server, and you are going to select a location for your server, and then you're gonna scroll down and you're gonna click Marketplace right here, and you're gonna type in Minecraft. Now we have three different Minecraft servers to choose from. We're going to choose the original one, which is Minecraft Java Edition Server. However, if you're interested in modding Minecraft, then you may want to look into Paper or the Forge Edition. And we're going to go ahead and select it. And then we're going to scroll down and you can change the server size. You can also choose the different types of dedicated CPUs, such as CPU optimized, memory optimized, storage optimized. I'm just gonna keep it as is for now in this tutorial. And then you can also add backups, automatic backups, either weekly or daily backups for a small fee if you'd like. And you can connect an SSH key here, or you can just log into your server later if you need to. For example, if you need to register an admin, and you can do it with a password. If you do wanna add an SSH key, you can click new SSH key. And then I also recommend that you check this, where it says add improved metrics, monitoring and alerting. This will show you some different graphs and track your server performance. And then we're gonna scroll down and I'm gonna select tutorial, but you can add it to whatever project you want. And we're gonna go ahead and click create droplet. And once your server has successfully powered on, you'll see a green dot right here, and you can go ahead and copy the IP address. You may need to wait a minute or two before you can access the Minecraft server. Then go ahead and open up Minecraft and click multiplayer, and then click add server and then put in whatever server name you'd like and paste in the server address here and click done. Then you can go ahead and join the server and start playing. And if you guys have any questions, just leave them down below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. And if you liked this video, make sure to like, comment and subscribe. And I hope you guys have an amazing rest of the day.